All right, so today I'm gonna do a full day of eating. I've been trying, attempting to do this for a few days now and I keep forgetting to film my last meal. I usually do the first one, I keep forgetting to film the last. So today I'm gonna do it. I woke up later today, I woke up at six, I usually wake up at four. So um, I, you know, I went to the gym and And um, I'm here now. I haven't consumed anything besides a scoop of the BSN pre-workout. Don't recommend, by the way. Um, and now it is 12.52. 12.52 and I'm getting ready to have some coffee, okay? So I just filmed a video and posted it for you guys on my um, not doing the warrior diet, but I just want to show you as an example. It's about to be one o'clock right now, and I have no intention on breaking my fast within the next hour to two hours. So sometimes I do go later, um, but I'm gonna make some coffee right now, and I'll show you what I put in the coffee. Lately I've been putting something in it. Alrighty, so I'm using this uh, Great Value Walmart brand Extra Rich Coffee Creamer. I use four servings, I use eight grams. Four servings is four grams of carbohydrates, uh, four grams of fat. And then I use 17 grams of this Truvia um, artificial sweetener, zero calories, okay? So that's what I do, and I put it in my coffee, tastes really, really good, really yummy. Um, and I'm uh, making my water right now, I'm gonna have that coffee. I had just realized that I gotta pick my mom up from the airport today because she came from Alaska. She went on a cruise to Alaska, so she's coming back today. So I figure that I will um, break my fast probably like around two um, because I think she said she's coming in at three, three thirty, four, one of those. Whenever I figure that out, and then I'll kind of set where I'm gonna kind of aim for, but I'll still film my meals, so. See you in the next one. Alrighty, so it is now 1.11, make a wish. And uh, my coffee is cooling off. Okay, so I'm about to drink that. Um, and then I'm going to make an omelet when I break my fast per usual. And I'll film that when that comes up. So now it is 2.33. I'm about to make my omelet. My mom gets in at 4.30, so I'm gonna eat now. I thought about just pushing it back, but I don't wanna you know, force feed later on this evening. So I'm gonna go ahead and make my omelet now. All right, got some coconut oil here. I'm gonna do, um, today, lately, the past couple days, I have been weighing out my food. Just to get a general, just general idea. I wanna make sure I'm consuming enough because I've been going to the gym, whereas a lot of the time, you know, in the past, month or so, I, I've been working out at home. But lately I've been going to the gym. When I go to the gym, I tend to have like a really much more intense workout. So I wanna um, I wanna make sure that I'm getting in enough calories. So that's why I've been tracking lately. Alrighty, that's let's see. 25 grams, all right. Add some kale and bacon. Just gonna do 40 grams of kale. And then I'm gonna put some waste of bacon. Clear that out. Do 70 grams of bacon. Alright, so it's gonna tear those pieces apart. I like to tear them up. I don't like to be cutting bacon. I like my bacon um like not crispy. Apparently, I didn't know until I made someone's bacon for them <laughs> that um, that's not necessarily everyone's cup of tea. <laughs> they were appalled that I would dare make their bacon not burnt. Alrighty. Alrighty, I have five eggs here. I'm gonna go ahead and crack those bad boys. What I like to do is I like to put them in a bowl, then add the salt, and then kind of whisk it a tad. I do not measure my salt. One day I should though. All right, so in this bottle is MCT oils. I'm gonna pour uh, 20 grams. 
I just started taking MCT oil. I wish I would have taken it earlier. I love this stuff. It is, um, it really, for me, it, it enhances my energy levels and my focus. Um, I, I knew, you know, I had heard about MCT oils for a long time, but I'm like, I get my MCTs in coconut oil. What's the big deal of the concentrated version? But not only that, I also realized it enhances my food. It doesn't have a taste really, but it, it makes the foods taste deeper in my experience. And so I, I've been enjoying that. Um, and what else about it? I'm, the first time I took it, I took too much. I took 28 grams, and if you've done any research on the on MCT oils, you'll hear the stories about how people get the runs. I'm not someone who tends to be excessively sensitive to like new foods and that sort of thing, but man, that time was bad. I even got like so nauseous and dizzy too. So that's pretty bad. But anyhow, I love it. MCT oil, I recommend it. Guys, look at that. Isn't that like, looks so freaking good. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna eat this. As I told you already what's in it, I'll tell you the macros afterwards. Man, that looks so good. Let me get that, get that in focus, yeah. Oh. So just a quick recap. I got up this morning at six, I slept in two hours later, I went to the gym right away, I worked out for an hour, and now I'm breaking my fast at 2.49, I believe it is right now, 2.49 p.m. Okay, I'm about to have that omelet. Alrighty, so yesterday is when I recorded my full day of eating, today is when I'm gonna share with you the macros of what yesterday ended up being. So if you recall meal one, I had around like 240 yesterday. It was 70 grams of bacon, 40 grams of kale, five eggs, 25 grams of coconut oil, and 20 grams of MCT oil, okay? So that was my largest meal, meal one, and ended up being 1,053 calories. It was eight grams of carbs, 98 grams of fat, 55 grams of protein, one gram of fat. Alrighty, it is now 6.39. I forgot to take my vitamins with my meal earlier. Usually I like to take them earlier. I forgot my spirulina, but yeah, I have two fish oil, I'm gonna get spirulina, I have a chromium, milk thistle, magnesium, and a digestive enzyme as long as, along with vitamin D. I have about eight ounces of tilapia that is defrosting, and I got like, um, I think it's a 1.8 ounces of onion in here with 35 grams of coconut oil. So I'm gonna cook that up, some spinach, half avocado. I was gonna do like um, like 12 grams of, of tilapia, but I decided I'm gonna have some sunflower seeds. I'm not really hungry. Um, I don't wanna force the issue, so um, I'm gonna have some sunflower seeds. I'll measure that. I'll let you guys know. Alrighty. So right here we have tilapia, onion, and avocado, okay? 8.6 ounces of tilapia, half a Haas avocado, and 1.8 grams of uh, onion, and 35 grams of coconut oil. Very yummy, turmeric, garlic powder, uh, red pepper powder, salt, and black pepper. So good, so, so good. Okay, and meal two, which was later on in the evening, I think it was like around seven, late six o'clock, seven. I had um, tilapia, and that was 8.3 uh, ounces, or I thought it was 8.6, no, 8.3, 8.3 ounces. Um, onion, 1.8 of onion ounces. Um, coconut oil, 35 grams. Avocado is half of a, a little Haas avocado. Um, and then uh, I put two cups of spinach. I think I really had one, but I just put two. And that totaled to be 654 calories, eight grams of carbs, 52 grams of fat, and 43 grams of protein. Yum, yum. So remember I told you I was gonna have the sunflower seeds. So I didn't count, I didn't end up counting that, but I had about half the bag. There was three servings in the bag. So I had about half of that. And so half of that bag would have been 255 calories, 23 grams of fat, and 11 grams of protein. Okay. And um, so, you know, what I had before then, as I said, I had that coffee, I had the NO explode, and that totaled to be 60 gram, um, calories, uh, nine grams of carbs, four grams of fat, and yeah, zero fiber. So my total for the day yesterday 
was 2,022 calories, 34 grams of carb, 10 of those carbs was fiber if we wanna take net carb, that would have been 24 grams of carb, but total carb, 34 grams. Fat, 177 grams of fat, and 109 grams of protein. So, that was my full day of eating. If you liked the full day of eating, if you want more of these, go ahead and leave it a thumbs up. Leave comments down below if you have any questions or comments. I will see you in the next video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Peace.